Hi everyone, it's the English Swimmer here and welcome back to the Black Widow Challenge. So in the last part, we actually killed off our eighth husband, which is just insane oh, to me. I yeah, cannot yeah. believe that we have like completed, <laughs> almost completed this. We've like done up to eight husbands. Aha. That's just insane to me. Um, so yeah, all the kids are kind of just waking up. <laughs> up and getting ready and stuff like that don't go and play with that you need to grab a quick meal you can have a quick meal of cereal eden's just uh making some Aww. breakfast i think um she actually got abducted again for like the second night in the row i don't really know why Eden's getting abducted so much. Some of you guys were commenting on the last part that it happened in. Um, some of you were like, the, Ed like, the aliens know Eden's secret. They want to know why she's killing people off. Which is probably very true, to be honest. The aliens are probably like, damn, this girl's doing our job for us. Like, she's like killing off these the species, which is what we should be doing. Because, you know, they're kind of like evil aliens. Um, but yeah, I think it's dead funny that she keeps getting abducted. Can you not mourn? Um, how about you go and actually watch some TV? You can, yeah, just go watch the TV and you can probably go do that as well. I'm going to put this in your inventory so that you don't lose it. Um, yeah, the kids kind of hang out in this room. This used to be our living room, but they're way more into this one, obviously, with, like, the big plasma screen. Uh, go watch the current channel. I don't know why Eve is watching the uh, cooking channel. Maybe she already knows that she's going to be the next Black Widow. <laughs> Maybe that's what she's doing. She's already trying to learn her cooking skill for this challenge. Um, but, yeah, everyone's kind of just, like, waking up and stuff like that. What do you need, little one? You can go play a video game game actually um you need to sit here first though because apparently this doesn't like to work when you aren't sat down eden has got rid of her sadness which is pretty good well it's still there but she's not as sad as she was which is quite a good thing we're gonna use this we're also gonna try and stay with the we're gonna try and stay with the inspired theme just because it takes away from our sadness i don't know if we're gonna get married in this part i kind of don't want to rush it now that we're coming to the end of this uh series i kind of don't want to rush things like we have plenty of time the boys i think it's actually their birthday today which is insane so we might throw a party for the boys in this part we'll uh yeah, throw a birthday party. Invite some of their friends around and stuff like that. Um, what's everyone doing? Right, you go and sit here. I want you to play video games. Uh, he's going to go watch a funny video with Jamie. Um, Jamie, you need to look after yourself, though. Um, ba -ba -ba, can you have some eggs and toast? Grab a serving of that. She's going to go sit over here, which is good because I want her to practice her typing. You know, she can do that. Uh, she needs to play three games of chess. Uh, right, we're going to play with, actually. We're going to go play with JJ because JJ is not doing anything. Uh, he just got up, which is good. Um, I'm going to have him have some breakfast, actually. So you come and grab a serving of this and... You can watch the um, comedy channel after you've done that. So yeah, these the two girls are... Oh no, JJ's playing some chess. Um, you need to do something to take you away from that place. Because she just wants to mourn people, which is so annoying. Go swim some laps, actually, Eve. Actually, you can play piano. I kind of do want her to um, get into piano a bit. I think she already knows a couple. Like, her skill... She has a little bit. Yeah, she has two piano. So um, she's not doing badly, but we haven't focused on it in a while. So we're going to have her do that. Uh, oh, something's broken. We're going to replace it. And a couple of you were like, what were you commenting? I was about to say it as well, but I can't remember what I was about to say. What was I about to say? Oh yeah, some of you are asking to have a baby with Zach, but I really don't want to. He's like the 
second to last husband so I really don't want to have another baby to be honest we have four kids that is more than I ever thought my black widow would have to be honest I wasn't planning on having four I was gonna stop after Eve but loads of you wanted another baby with Jason um, but I really don't want another one so sorry to those of you who did want another black widow child but that ain't gonna happen um, just because I really don't want it to, to be completely honest. Uh, he's just watching that. Everyone's doing what I want them to do, which is good. Uh, he's, why are you watching a funny video? You need to use this. And is it actually the boy's birthday? They have like this little slit here, but it says zero days till aging up. And we haven't got the thing saying that it's their birthday. Oh well, we'll age them up, you know, we can do that. We'll bake some cakes whilst they're um, at school and then we'll kind of just invite everyone around. How long does Eve have? She has five days until she ages up. What the? That's so crazy. That's actually insane. But yeah, everyone should go. Actually, you know what? We're going to have Eve skip school because it's Eve and she hates it and she's like why is my game freezing so much at the minute it's so annoying seems to be after the patch update it's not doing too well uh we're gonna play a game with Eden because I feel like Eden definitely needs to uh prove to her him that she's like a nerd or like likes enjoys video games which she hasn't done yet so we're gonna try and do that and yeah we're just gonna spend the day I think he probably has work yeah he has work at 9 a.m. anyway is he feeling good yeah he's feeling fine for work so yeah we're just gonna spend the day with Eden and Eve we're gonna get ready for the boys party we'll prom we might go to a club actually we might go to um the little the not the really fancy one not the discotheque but the other club like the smaller one which looks like a bar i think we might go there for the boy's birthday and have a night out <laughs> we'll obviously leave the kid at home but i think yeah i think we're gonna do that it's been a while since we've been out in the black widow and a ton of you have been commenting on who you want eden's next husband to be and it seems like a lot of you want the goth himself mr mortimer goth obviously so all throughout this challenge mortimer and bella bella's kind of been like our best friend like we met her she was the first sim we met, um, and she's just a really, really good friend of ours. Like, even, like, Katrina isn't even our good friend anymore. It's basically just our family and Bella. But I feel like she's been our... She's been backup for us so she works as a secret agent she probably knows what's been going on but she has been like our companion throughout this whole challenge she hasn't told anyone but i think mortimer also knows but i think he wants to dob us in so that's probably put strain on the goths marriage and i'm sure bella would just be like you know what eden take him off my hands i will remarry someone so i think we're gonna try and make a move on mortimer we're gonna invite him round where is he in our thing it is gonna be a little bit hard because we do have like a negative thing we're gonna invite him to hang out at our current lot um counter bullying strategy Stratagem. Is that how you say that? Strategem? I don't know. Now that Jamie gets pretty good grades, some bullies have been picking on him lately. We're well, gonna ignore them. It takes fair amount of self-control, but ignoring the bullies works. Eventually, they get bored and move on to a different target. Jamie feels a little bad for the other kid, but hey, school is a jungle sometimes. And Mortimer will be right over. We should probably have got, like, a flirty shower um but uh, see he's running to us he is running he is a desperado so we are going to go and invite him in he doesn't like our kid either dude you are just giving us more and more reason to kill you which you probably shouldn't do at this point in time because I already kind of want you to be the last kill and the last kill is gonna be trapped 
in this room and we're just gonna bleed them dry we're just gonna watch them die slowly and painfully but yeah loads of you actually wanted it to be mortimer so um we are going to describe a new idea to him we're also going to get to know him a little bit and have a deep conversation let's try and get more friendly with him because you know they have been through some ups and downs i feel like he's tried to flirt with us numerous times and he's kind of like caught us out and like wound up our husbands and stuff what's wrong with you world wary for those what? For those with sophisticated taste, some TV channels are merely... Okay, whatever. We're gonna give him a heartfelt compliment. Oh, he's going into Eve. I'm sure Eve won't mind. Eve will be like, get it, mom. <laughs> so uh, I can imagine her being like really all for this. Zach notices everyone grinning and laughing, but chat windows disappear when he comes around. He can pretend not to notice or ask what's up. At first, no one answers until the new intern shifts to let Zack see his screen. It's a doctored f up photo, alright. But the axe wielding mutant isn't Zack. It's his boss, which is easy enough to laugh off. Okay. Cool. Cool story, bro. Um, right, let's try and get a little bit flirty with him. We're gonna ask if he's single. I know he's not, because he's obviously married to Bella. He's like lolling. He's like, no, I'm married to Bella. You know this. You know me, Eden. Um, but still, it's not gonna. We're gonna compliment his appearance. He's like, oh, thanks. Thanks, Eden. Okay, let's get a little. Let's flirt with him a bit. He wants it, to be fair. He has been like... I feel as if he's been flirting with us all throughout this challenge to prove that we are the Black Widow. But what he doesn't realize is that we are really good at like our calling in life. So we can kill him off like that. Jada Rose... I heard you got engaged. Congratulations. I'm so excited for you and Jack. Zach, not Jack. Um, flirt with him again. And we're going to exchange numbers with him. We have to do this whilst he's out. What time do you work till 5 p.m.? Okay, we got this. We got this. We got plenty of time. We can do this. He's like, mm -mm. I'm finally catching the Black Widow. No, you aren't. Because we are going to kill you off before you get to tell anyone. And your wife is in on this. Bella is so in on this. We're going to invite Bella to the party. We aren't going to invite Mortimer. But we'll uh, invite Bella. And we'll be like, hey girl. We're going to share a secret. And that secret is going to be that we managed to flirt with Mortimer. And he was all for it. Um, let's... Um, blow him a kiss and compliment his appearance. There's the bold pickup line. He is falling hard. Maybe he is just like pretending as well, though. This could all be a front. Let's flirt with him again. This could very much be a front. Um, ask a risque question and. Compliment his appearance again. And we're also going to flirt. I feel like we should probably try a first kiss, like, right now. Let's just do it. Let's get it out of the way. How are you feeling? Oh, you're super hungry. You can stop uh, playing. Um, go and grab some garden salad. Grab a serving of that. Here we go. I think this is going to be the first kiss. Bum, bum, bum. I want to get a screenshot. Yes, and it's right in front of the secret bookcase. How appropriate is that? <laughs> Mortimer looks so shocked. He's like, oh, my plan's working. I'm finally going to catch the Black Widow. No, you aren't. We're better than you. Uh, we're going to whisper seductively. And we should also ask him about his career. Because I don't know what Mortimer does. I don't know whether he's a secret agent too. Awesome. We'll ask him though. <laughs> what are you? He's a writer. Oh, he's trying to get the scoop on us. We're going to go make out in a closet like naughty teenagers. That's what we're going to do. <laughs> right, come on you two. There they go. Those two are uh, 
Yeah, gonna go make out in the closet. Oh, it's gonna be her daughter's closet. Eve's like so proud. Eve's just like, get it, mom. <laughs> She's just like, my mom has more game than me. Movie. Look at her. She's like, come on. <laughs> incredible oh there's like two little love hearts as well when they make out they aren't like trying for a baby or anything they're just literally just making out remember when kissing could make a baby in the sims lol good times is this cow plant hungry yeah right we're gonna go feed it and um are you gonna take that with you? Yes, yeah, she is. Okay, that's good. We'll also use this. And how is Eden? We need to bake the boys' cakes. Stop making out. Stop acting like teenagers in love. And <laughs> come and bake. Oh no. Uh, cook. We're gonna do. Can we do a gourmet one? Um, cook a gourmet meal. We're gonna go for one of these cakes they can share the same cake like i can't be bothered having two we'll just have to put candles on it really quickly for both of them uh we should probably send mortimer home is no he's not going okay well we're gonna get eve to do this eve's gonna be like can you leave ask him to leave eve <laughs> eve's like our little bouncer she's like uh hey can you please leave the premises <laughs> can you please get out okay come on let's do this come on eden i should really get going now thanks for hanging out with me you are welcome why are you doing that aren't you like a level 10 in gourmet cooking oh no she's only a three in gourmet that makes sense oh you're super tired oh that's because she uh she got thingy didn't she she got abducted, so she didn't really sleep. Okay, I guess she can sleep after you've done that. Oh, why are you angry? Oh, Eve's getting a call. The principal is calling. No, I don't want to answer it. Hang up, Eve. Who gives a cookies about <laughs> the principal? The boys don't need to do their homework either because they're going to age up in this part. So there's really no point in doing homework. But you can take a shower and use this. You, mister, also... Oh, why are you so tired? Go have a little bit of a sleep. This is annoying that everyone's so tired. I don't understand why. Is Eve pretty tired as well? You can go take a sleep too. Um, She's going to grab a serving of some... <laughs> she's like so angry. Oh, what a little cutie. We're going to put this in e Eden's inventory. Uh... He's not tired, so that's a good thing. He's just a little bit hungry. So we're going to open this. We're going to grab a serving of this. You also need to do your homework. Um, but you also need to pee. So use this after you've done. And then, Destiny, you can do your homework like a look good little girl. We're going to have these two sleep for a little bit. Eden's also sleeping for a little bit. Just to get her energy up. Oh, we need to take a picture of uh, Zach as well, actually. That is what we need to do. Um, before before we... I can't remember what I was saying. Oh, uh, well. Never mind. <laughs> Clearly wasn't that important. Right, come on, everyone. Let's do this. Uh, oh, you're doing... Did you even... You did not finish that salad. Girl, what are you playing at? Eat this salad eat your garden salad you can watch the kids channel as you do this watch the kids network have some fun and then you can do your homework put this in your inventory there we go you can do your homework after don't worry kiddo you can have a chill you know it's been a hard day at school and you're gonna come watch the current channel too whilst you eat your salad everyone else is asleep so it's kind of just these two the two siblings getting on with each other He's going to come back from work any minute. He's feeling playful. Oh, it's because uh, cause of the boss thing. Uh, he really needs a shower. Take a shower and grab a serving of that. How are these lot doing? Okay. These two are so tired. But to be fair, Eden did get abducted. So I can see why she's tired. I don't know why JJ is so tired. I think he was up pretty early. He got up at like 3am. And I was like, why are you awake right now? Like, you do not need to be awake. Um, Eden is feeling okay. 
I have probably get eaten up in a minute. Um, she can use the bathroom. And we'll just order some food whilst we're out. When we're at the bar, we can order food. Um, I don't even know if the boys have many friends, to be completely honest. They're all going to be teenagers, because no one else can age up. Like, in the rules of the challenge, you have to disable aging for anyone else in the town. Um, so yeah, no one else is going to really age up, unless I age them up like manually yeah manually that's the word i was like automatically or manually no manually um so i might do that but i'm not too sure okay we should probably get everyone up you know you've all slept for long enough you mister are happy uh you should wake up and you can wake up too um he is like the most tired you really need to pee go use this one and then we're gonna throw the birthday party. What is happening? Whose phone was just ringing? Oh, his. Burr, 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 burr. Answer it. Luna Varel would like to come hang out. Oh, hey girl. Maybe she actually does like Jamie. Maybe we'll age her up today. Um, sure. You can come hang out, even though we'll probably invite you to our party any second. Um, but you can come hang out. Uh, we should... Does she know Luna? I kind of want one of the boys to throw it, because then I know that they can invite their friends. Okay, we'll have Jamie do it. So, let's plan a social event. Come on, dude. Come on, let's do this. And it is going to be a birthday party. I don't want it to be a prestige event, to be honest. And one birthday sim... Can we have two? Yeah, we can. Because they're twins, obviously. So they're like the birthday sims. And the guests, bam, bam. She's not going to come because it is going to be in a bar. Morgan, Katrina can come. Bella, not Mortimer. Uh, just because I don't want him flirting with us. Um, Zoe... Wolfgang can come, Luna can come, Tabitha can come, even though she's a kid. I kind of do want to make her a teen, because she was our friend. She was um, Eve's friend when... And I kind of want to make this kid a teen too, so I'll probably do that, to be honest. I'll probably do that off screen, but there are guests. The caterer can be Clara, because I know she can cook. The mixologist can be... I'm sure there'll be one at the bar, to be honest. And the entertainer. Why are all the ghosts entertainers? That's weird. And we're going to have it. Um, is it this? No. Which bar is it? I think it's the Narwhal Arms. It's either the Narwhal Arms or the Old Quarter Inn. Hmm. I think it's the Narwhal Arms. Yeah, it's a nightclub. So, yeah, we're going to have it here. Uh, there we go, and it's gonna be a birthday party for the boys. Uh, we do have our birthday cake. Hopefully there is a place to set it out. If not, then I can just buy a little table or something. Hopefully there'll be a DJ on, I'm hoping, um, because they are turning up into young adults. So it's kind of like a 21st birthday. That's how I see them aging from a teen. I know 20 isn't a teenager. Or they're 18th, I guess. Yeah, in the UK, you can drink at 18. I know in America, you can't. Um, but yeah, it's kind of like one of those big, those big parties, isn't it? So uh, there is a little table that I think we can put our cake on. So uh, let's grab this cake out of here. And we're going to add birthday candles, just so I know no one's going to eat it. But here we go, we're at our party. Um, Luna isn't here though, which is annoying. Where's Luna? We're going to invite her to hang out at our current lot. Uh, invite to hang out at current lot. Oh, look at these two. She's like, happy birthday, brother. <laughs> we're going to take a picture together. Actually, I want to take an actual picture. Um, take, oh no, not take I'm selfie. Big. Oh, look at them. They're like teasing. Oh no, she's annoyed by it. <laughs> take a photo with JJ. And we'll get one with Jamie as well. He's such a little wind up. He's like, oh, like making her jump. Bless him. Bless her even. He's the one being mean. Oh, look at them. 
My little babies. He's not going to be a baby for much longer. He's going to look exactly the same, but I want to get a picture when he is a teen. And let's take one with Jamie, too. Go and take one. Oh, this is so cute. Go on, go take one with him. There we go. Celebrate JJ's birthday by throwing him a rocking birthday party. I'm trying. I'm trying to make it rocking. I'm trying. Oh, look at them. My little babes. Eden must be so proud. She has some beautiful, beautiful kids. Like, she really, really does. I'm, like, so impressed with how these kids turned out. Did Luna show up or not? Look, JJ's talking to her as well. We're going to give her a friendly intro. <gasps> hey Morgan, I can see her being good for him to be honest. Maybe the boys are gonna gonna get some relationships here. Let's have a gossip and let's compliment her outfit. We'll also thank her for coming, um, discuss interests with her. Is Luna even here? I don't think she is. I don't oh, here she is. She just arrived. She's like super angry though. <laughs> so I might age up um, Morgan and Luna off screen before the next part, to be honest, because I may as well. And I think we're just going to age the boys up now. Um, I kind of... Right, we're going to thank her for coming and we're going to express our admiration, um, discuss interests... Um, <laughs> tell a dramatic story and ask her if she's single. Let's try it. He already knows her quite well. Like, these two have been talking quite a lot. Let's flirt with her a little bit. <gasps> What's Eve doing? Um, oh, she's hugging Eden. Why is there not, like, anyone DJing? Is there even a DJ here? Hire staff. We're going to hire a DJ headliner because we can. So we may as well. And we're going to go order a drink. Uh, we're going to order our favorite drink. I don't know what Eve's favorite drink is going to be. But um, we'll order it. Is this the headliner? Is this the DJ? Yeah. Apparently so. Oh, look. Eden and Bella. I knew it. Bella is so in cahoots with us. Oh, man. That's incredible. Is this even going down? Why isn't this 10 minutes? What? We haven't even blown out our candles. Go blow out your candles, dude. Um, I'm going to also... Have we even tried to flirt with her? I don't think we have. Let's flirt. JJ is becoming an adult. Okay, there we go. He is now an adult. Bam. Um, he doesn't look any different. So this is JJ as an adult. Um, we're going to add some more birthday candles. He's like, yeah, uh, I don't look any different. <laughs> um, we are going to make him. He is clumsy. He loves the outdoors. So I think what, sh what else should we make him? He's clumsy and loves the outdoors. Um, hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know what I want to make him. Clumsy, loves the outdoors, and we will make him family oriented. He does seem pretty family oriented, so let's do that. Um, is she like even explicit? She's, like, not even accepting our flirtation. She really, really isn't. Right, dude, can you move out the way? Go over here. Okay, we're going to add some more birthday candles. Oh, who took a piece? Gosh darn it, you. You little shite. Now we can't age him up. How am I meant to age him up? Oh, my goodness. That was meant for both of you. Jeez Louise, I want to age Jamie up. We're going to have to do it at home now. Gosh darn it, we could just age him up and create a sim to be fair. But I kind of don't want to do that. They're like, that's Why is this glitching out too? My game is going so weird right now. It's like freezing. It's been doing that a lot recently though. Um, it's kind of annoying. It seems to be since, since the patch. Um, are you just in a group with her? I want to go dance with her. Um, 
Are these two in a relationship? Because they seem pretty... We're going to exchange numbers with her. And we're also going to compliment her appearance a bit. And flirt with her a little bit. Okay, there we go. The headline is here, so that's good. She dancing? No, have a dance. Why aren't people dancing? Where's our mum too? Oh, she's just having a drink. <laughs> of course she is. Go dance. How are the boys doing? Jamie, are you flirting? Yes, you are. We have a little bit of flirtation going on between him and Luna. Thank goodness for that. That took a while, didn't it? Uh, let's get to know her a little bit more. Oh, they're even in like a big group conversation and she's still accepting our flirtation. That never usually happens, like at all. This kid we need to age up. We need to age everyone up, I swear. And her. I might do this off screen um, just after this party finishes. But I'm really annoyed that we can't fucking use this cake again because everyone took a piece. Gosh darn it. Can you go dance together? Uh, yeah, I think they're going to go dance together, so that's good. And Zach just learnt the dancing skill. Why aren't you dancing? Uh, oh, dance together. I just said go here together, so that's a little bit weird. These two are just in a group by themselves. That's actually adorable, though. That is so, so cute. You, she didn't even get her drink. Everyone's just having a grand old time dancing now. This is cute. Look. Look at all our kids having a fun time. Eden's dancing the night away. Zach's dancing. Everyone's having... Whoa, Luna's getting down. Girl can dance, man. Ooh. Okay, so I think I'm going to end this part here, guys. Just because I do kind of want to age everyone up whilst everybody is in the same room and stuff like that. So I'm going to end this part here. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this part. Not too much happened on the Black Widow side of things. But, you know, we did want to spend a little bit of time with the kids. You know, it's their birthday. So I feel like we should definitely spend some time on the twins, focusing on them a little bit and i'm happy that we did so thank you guys so much for watching if you like this part please do give it a big thumbs up do leave all of your comments and suggestions down below and i will speak to you all in the next part bye guys